Hello guys, we are back with our next lecture. In this lecture, let us go through planarity testing algorithm guys. So it includes uh, three major steps guys. So the first step is if a graph is a disconnected graph, then it has a uh, several components. So in that situation, we should take one component at a time. So assume that a particular graph is disconnected, it is having two different parts. So to test the planarity, you will be selecting the first part and if you will be checking the planarity and once you got the planarity result, whether it is a planar graph or not, then you will be moving on to the next planar, next component. So in that way you should work. So that's the first step. You should check whether it is a plan, it is a disconnected or connected graph. Okay. So once it is done, if a graph has parallel edges or self loops, please remove them. Okay. So if there are any vertex with the graph of a degree two, we can merge them guys. So this the last step is really important because this is the only step which is repeated again and again guys. Okay. Okay. So let us take a small example. So uh, let me take a piece of paper guys so that we can solve it. So if possible, you also please take a piece of paper. Okay. 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 Let us start. Okay. So A, B, C, D and E. Okay. So if you observe here, there are multiple vertices with degree two, right? So here it is a vertex, here also it is a vertex, here also it is a vertex. So for ease, let us convert this E, let us merge this E guys. So if you merge E, so merging E is nothing but deleting E guys, you can assume in that way also. Okay. Yes. Okay. So once you merge it, okay, I think it should be till here. Sorry for that guys. Okay. So once you merge E, the result will be in this way guys. So it is already in between E here. It is nothing but E guys. You can say E. Okay. So it is not an edge now. Please remember. Sorry. It is not a vertex now. Please remember that. Okay. A, B. Okay. Now, similarly, let us now merge the next, next values. Okay. So now where the degree is a two guys. So if you observe carefully at here, also the degree is a two. Here the degree is 3, here the degree is 3, here the degree is 4, right? Yes. So let us merge this A now. Okay. So if you merge that A, it will be converted into a parallel edge, right? Yes. Even this is also a parallel edge which you can remove. Yes, I forgot about that. Okay. So you got in this way. Okay. So this is a C, D, sorry, D, C, B, D. And here it is a parallel edge that is nothing but A which you can remove. Okay, so at the end you ended up with a small triangle. Okay, so small triangle with A, D and B. So you can remove any one. So let us assume you try to remove this only C. Let us try to merge C. So at the end you will be getting one more parallel edge. Which you can remove. Which you can remove. So once you remove it, you gonna get B and D. So at the end you managed to get a single result, right? So it is not having... It is not a disconnected graph. It is not having any planar, planar, sorry, parallel edges or loops. It is not having any degree equal to two. Hence, at the end, you reach it to the planar graph. So at the end, you can conclude that as a planar graph. So you can you do the same process that is written here, guys. Okay. So I hope everyone got a clear idea on this. So in the next lecture, we'll be going through five color graph theorem, guys. Okay. So let us meet in the next lecture. Thank you. Thanks for watching.